Watusi, also called Ancoli Watusi, is a breed of domestic cattle from East Africa. They developed out of the Sangha cattle, which are the background cattle of Africa, around Lake Victoria and its surrounding countries. Also known as the King of Cattle, Watusi go back thousands of years and can be seen in cave drawings and Egyptian tomb paintings. In Rwanda, Watusi are known as Insanga, meaning the ones which were found, because according to tradition, they had been discovered by the first kings. Watusi cattle were brought to North America by way of Canada and later in the early 1970s, finally into the United States. The Ancoli Watusi International Registry was formed in 1983 to promote the breed in North America. Watusi are a medium-sized cattle breed. They have a straight top line and a sloping rump, and may have a neck hump. Watusi present in a variety of colors. Dark red predominates, although dun and black also occur. They may be solid or spotted. Some unusual spotting patterns can be present, including one in which color runs across the top of the animal with white on the lower body. They may also have many different types of speckling. Their most notable feature is their horns, which have a large base and are long and symmetrical. Crescent or lyre-shaped horns are the most desired in Africa, but American breeders have also selected for a lateral horn conformation that increases the length from tip to tip. Since they developed in Africa, where temperatures can be extreme, Watusi have adapted by circulating blood through their large, unique horns, where it is cooled and then returned to the body, allowing excess heat to dissipate. Calves are small and robust able to stand and run in short order. They have low birth weights of between 30 to 50 pounds, but grow quickly on their mother's rich milk, which has 10% butter fat. On average, mature male Watusi weigh between 1,000 to 1,600 pounds while mature females weigh between 900 to 1200 pounds. Although seen by some as a novelty, Watusi have a docile nature despite their horns and make good heifer bulls with their low birth weights. Cows offer high butter fat and are being crossed with dairy breeds to improve milk quality. They adapt well to harsh environments and produce lean beef. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like, and share. Don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you'll be notified whenever a new video is posted.